Ah. Hey everybody. Welcome to the vocabulary lesson. Now this is the 10th vocabulary lesson and then now I have two words that I want to go over which is um, mental, mentally, and mentality. And then next, touche. Okay, the word I'm going to be talking about, which is mental. Mental, relating to the mind, men, mental faculties, synonyms, intellectual, cerebral, brain, rational, cog, cognitive. Okay, next, mental faculties, relating to disorders of the mind. A mental hospital, synonyms, psychiatric, psych psychological, psych psychogenic, a mental disorder, when something is absolutely insane or just downright gnar, G-N-A-R, that barrel was straight up mental meaning someone who was silly or stupid, usually for attention and in a random or sporadic way, involving nonsensical references and actions, usually violent or quick action involved, resulting in general amusement and hilarity of onlookers. Hey, look, Archie's jumping off that cliff while holding a banana. Wow, he's mental. This person is mental retarded, means their brains were not fully formed when they were born and it makes learning more difficult for them. Mentally challenged. Retarded needs psych psychologic help. That dude's mental because he fucked his own sister. Mental issues. They have a strange behavior. Temperamental means when they get mad easily, a tendency to exhibit uncontrolled anger. Irrit irritability, a mental condition of moderation and calm, especially in the phrases keep one's temper, lose one's temper, out of temper, temperamental, expressive of your emotional character. A temperamental young man of a machine is temperamental. It sometimes works and sometimes does not. Our VCR can be temperamental. A temperamental person is someone whose mood often changes very suddenly. Be careful how you approach her. She's very temperamental, caused by your own character and feelings. There are temperamental similarities between the brothers. Informal. A temperamental machine sometimes works and sometimes does not. You have to treat our DVD player very carefully. It's old and temperamental. Mental illness means homeless people has mental issues living on the street alone. No home, no life. It's poor. No money. Life is miserable. Homeless people get mad and angry and frustrated when they don't have a life. He has mental issues, meaning he has mental problems. I like your mental attitude, which means positive mental attitude. PMA is a concept first introduced in 1937 by Napoleon Hill in the book Think and Grow, which positive mental attitude is that philosophy which asserts that having an optimistic disposition in every situation in one's life attracts positive changes and increases achievement mental attitude.
a complex mental state involving beliefs and feelings and values and dispositions to act in certain ways. He had the attitude that work was fun. And mentally, in a manner relating to the mind, soldiers become physically and mentally exhausted. Synonyms. And one's mind and one's head inwardly, intellectually, cognitively, mentally, I was prepared to deal with the situation in or with the mind or intellect, intellectually with regard to the mind. I mean, physically, mentally, you know, in every way, shape, and form. Recall how Clinton returned to Arkansas from the campaign trail to preside over the execution of a mentally disabled man. One in five Pennsylvania in inmates are classified as mentally ill. How do you survive that mentally, physically, and emotionally? They want to hold the seat that Giffords had to give up after being shot in the head by a mentally ill man. Physically, he had considerably improved, but mentally, he was not yet recovered. I had to get mentally into harmony with the people in conditions. I found about me. It is doubtful if it was mentally prepared to entertain it or evolve the idea for he was ponderous spiritually and mentally as well as materially. But I do not love you, Sidney replied mentally but steadily. Mentally challenged. A sexuality of which the mentally challenged one only dates non-binary, binary. I don't know how to pronounce that. That word is so new to me. Non-binary. B-I-N-A-R-Y. Binary, binary. I don't know how to pronounce that. This causing the person to lose the title of pansexual or omnisexual because of their restrictions of gender. The boy says, who's that new girl over there? Boy number two, don't even try for her. She's mentally challenged. Mentally challenged, nice word for retarded. So lie man is having an extra chromosome. He is mentally challenged, someone who is mentally challenged by the simple task, in other words, a mentally retarded person. He can't even put this pants on. He must be mentally challenged. You mentally described about the car because you have an image in your mind of explaining the whole good details about the car, the room, and the office. Expressing themselves with words. Describe about the car physically. And you are standing in front of the car by speaking in good, te in good details with correct words. And somebody will say, I mentally know what you describe. I mentally picture that. I can mentally see that. I can mentally understand that. So... Mentally challenged, uh, from back in the day, my friend had said this to me. So, my friend asked me about his own friend. He said, hey, Brandon, um, what does he look like? I was like, um, he looks like um, a raccoon monster type thing. And now, my friend said it to me. He says, oh, wow, huh. He's mentally challenged, you know, because I will always going to be comparing people as animals every day. Mentally and physically. Mental, the adjective mental describes anything having to do with the mind just as physical. Has to do with the intellect, the mind, or the brain. There is a history of mental illness in that family. Which is 
interesting because, sorry, physically, they're all so amazing. Physical qualities, actions, or things are connected with a person's body rather than with their mind. The physical and mental problems caused by the illness, the attraction between them is physical. You may be physically and mentally exhausted after a long flight. Disabled people who cannot physically, who, who cannot physical things are real things that can be touched and seen rather than ideas or spoken words. Mental disability, a mental disorder also called a mental illness or psychiatric Disorder is a behavioral or mental pattern that causes significant distress or impairment of personal functioning. Mental disorders are usually defined by a combination of how a person behaves, feels, perceives, or thinks. Mentally, mentally be happy. Use your imagination to make this happiness a real thing. Are you mentally aware of that? Are you mentally aware of that situation? Mentally means you have an image in your mind. The mind is your mental mentality. A mentality is a way of thinking or the ability to think and learn. If someone says you have the mentality of a kindergarten, that's great. If you're in, if you're in kindergarten, but if you're in 10th grade, they're probably calling you immature. Mentalities is plural. A mindset, a way of thinking before he can succeed, he will have to shed the mentality that he can get by without hard work. If someone says you have the mentality of a kindergartner, that's great. If you're a kindergartner, but if you're in 10th grade, they're probably calling you immature. An obvious part of the now mentality is the word mental, which means of the mind. Mentality is a noun. Mentalities is plural. Victim mentality. Victim mentality is an acquired personality trait in which a person tends to recognize themselves as a victim of a negative actions of others and to behave as if this were the case in the face of contrary evidence of such circumstances. Victim mentality depends on clear thought, process, and attribution, mental power or capacity intelligence, mode or way of thought, outlook, the imperialist mentality of the 19th century, John Davies. Most teenagers do not have the mentality to foresee the consequences of such risky behavior. Dal Walter carried that same mentality over to race day. Now, this is the same leftist mentality that has led to, of course, the, the destruction of histor hysterical markers and statues all over the country. In today's world, the trend of peace and cooperation is moving forward and the Cold War mentality and zero-sum game thinking are outdated. Mentality, a particular way of thinking, mental ability, mental power or capacity, mode or weight of thought. Okay, yeah, so that's mentally and okay. So now I'm gonna go up to touche. Alright, touche. In fencing used as an acknowledgement of a hit by one's opponent. Used as an Acknowledgement during discussion of a good or clever point made at one's expense by another person, other person's better thinking just verbally slapped you, used sarcastically to indicate that one is unable to argue against, an, against another's absurd logic or a witty point. Bart says, I want to go with you, Dad. Homer says, don't you have school, Bart? Don't you have work? Homer, ah, touche. Touche means true. That means true. 
It's an expression borrowed from French use to admit that an opponent in an argument has made a good point when someone has said a good comeback line to concede a... Concede? That's a hard one. C-O-N-C-E-D-E. Concede. A point to an opponent when fencing. You only think that because that what you raise to believe. Maybe or maybe... You only think that because that's what you were raised to believe. Touche. Why can't you put the toilet down? Why can't you get a job and stop flirting with other guys? Touche. Touche. You got me. That's another point for you. French word used in fencing commonly used today to recognize the other side's good argument or come back. Roughly translates to, oh shit. I didn't think of that. Guy number, guy number one says, You know Mountain Dew shrinks your balls? Guy number two, At least I have balls. Guy number one, Touche. Means true. If one person presents an argument and another delivers a... Another delivers a clever or appropriate response, the first person may respond with Touche as a way of acknowledging a good response. When I was at the strip club the other night, stripper, someone's face got a little close to my ass. Me. Someone's face got a little close to my face. Trip, stripper says, touche. When you say something to someone and they have no reply back for it, Joe says, hey dude, I fucked your girlfriend. Bill says, Hey, dude, I fucked your mom. Joe says, huh, touche. You say touche when you want to admit that the other person in an argument has won a point. Usually with the shirt and witty remark, touche means, oh, I didn't know that. It means something very different. It confuses me sometimes. Like, I thought that, that means true, but now it comes up and says, oh, I didn't know that. A comeback line so good, it, it can't be topped. A point so good, it can't be disproved, topped. A word derived from French that is used most commonly when someone makes a particularly good point in an argument and leaves the opponent. The touche sayer. Speechless or at a loss for words. If incest is a sin, then what the fuck does that make Adam and Eve? Uh, uh touche. Okay. Done. The lesson is over. Hope you enjoy the lesson, people.